Okay, I'm in front of 5624 Otter Way in Florence. Um, three bedroom, two and a half bath, 1,751 square feet. Listed for $575,000. It was built in 1995 and has been updated and remodeled and sits on just over, well, just under a third of an acre, 0.32 of an acre. So it is absolutely gorgeous. We are out here in the North Lakes District. It took me 11 minutes to get from the bridge, so Old Town, out here, and there was some pretty good traffic. So 10, 12 minutes tops. Very, very quiet, very peaceful, all beautiful, you know, um, homes in this little U-shaped um, neighborhood off of Sutton Lake Road. There's a fire department right down there. This is on a uh, septic system and public water with Hasita water. Um, it is just absolutely glorious. It is a gardener's delight. They do have smart irrigation throughout. And I'm gonna take you a little neighborhood, a little yard stroll here. They have um, a little fire pit in the back. They have a deck and a hot tub, but these little paths to the whole yard are just really gorgeous. They do some hand watering as well, so we'd have to find out more about the irrigation system here. I think they are taking all their potted plants, but just absolutely glorious. Um, raspberries back here, lots of rhododendrons, and just absolutely one of the prettiest yards I've seen in a long time with lots of rock work, um, great grass area. The backyard is fully fenced for your dog, which would be great. Um, hardy plank siding, roof looks like it is in great condition. I personally know these sellers and they are just meticulous in everything that they do. So their home shows the love and care. And they are staying in this community, they're just moving to a different house because they love it here in Florence. So great little seating area here in the morning, cup of coffee out here. You walk in, we have tile floors and then real oak wood floors throughout as well. Um, good sized living room, vaulted ceiling, the ceiling fan, wood burning fireplace. Opens up um, through this archway to a nice size dining room. Really bright and cheery, this whole house. Um, I love the detailing of the um, chair rail and um, crown molding. Beautiful windows looking out into this gorgeous backyard. Extra storage here into the kitchen. Built-in um, oven. Stainless steel appliances, side-by-side -side refrigerator, granite countertops. I'm not going to try to guess what kind of wood these cabinets are. And there is the dishwasher. Nice undermount, very deep undermount sink with a great garden window letting all that light. Here is that cooktop that you could definitely replace with... Um, a uh, propane cooktop if you wanted to, and a built-in microwave. Um, really nice natural stone backsplash. They have an additional like office seating area here off the kitchen, lots of built-ins. And then we're gonna make our way around. Good size pantry. Oh, coat, not pantry, coat closet, my apologies. I don't know why I thought this was a pantry. There we go. And then they have a laundry room as well with um, a hanging rack and lots of cabinetry. Just to give you perspective, we came in right through there. And then here's the attached good size two car garage, lots of storage on both sides. So this is not just a traditional little tiny two car garage, built in storage over there and more storage there. There is attic access as well over there with the pull down ladder and the little powder room to serve as your guest bath for anyone who comes over like for dinner. Also with granite countertops. Nice paint job throughout this home. So we're gonna head upstairs and then I will come down and then we'll head out to the backyard. So some carpeted stairs here. I will tell you they are a little on the steep side. 
but the rewards are beautiful up here. Bright, huge guest room. Uh, dual vinyl, dual pane vinyl windows throughout. Guest room, the carpet is in great shape here. Nice little, we'll call it a walk-in closet. I'd call it maybe more of a step-in closet, but there is a little pocket door there. Little landing area. Kind of gives you an idea of what we're looking at down there in the living room. Additional storage here. A hall closet, linen closet here. Full bath, which has an updated vanity. So this is a fiberglass um, shower tub surround. Wainscoting. Great little cute vanity here. With granite countertops, undermount sink. Very beachy. Very nice and bright. And then they are using this as a craft office room. It is technically the third bedroom. That beautiful oak flooring continues up here in this room. Really nice view to the backyard. And a good sized closet in here for a third bedroom. And then around the corner, tucked away all by itself, is the primary suite. Really nice size room in here. This is a king size bed, so that gives you kind of a feeling of how large this room is. Vaulted ceilings, ceiling fan. Nice windows facing due east, so you'll get some great morning sunshine in here. I will pan around so you can see how big this room really is if that's a king size bed. And then there's a little seating area over here. Nice little nook area, and then really lovely walk-in closet. If I could find a light switch, there's got to be a light switch. Oh, there it is. I apologize. So built-ins, lots of built-ins in this closet, places for your shoes, all of that. And then this master primary suite bathroom is just glorious. Nice, beautiful tile floors, um, solid surface countertops, some kind of maybe Corian it feels like, but lots and lots of storage here. Nice sitting area to sit and put on your shoes. And then this beautiful step in shower with the very tall glass doors dual shower heads, rain shower, and a traditional shower head and that great little um, accent um, tile work there. Great little shower nook. And then lots and lots of nitro light coming in. Just really a very well done master primary. Sorry, I'm supposed to use the word primary now. Primary bathroom. So we will go downstairs and I can show you this absolutely exquisite backyard to go with um, the front yard I already showed you. Back downstairs through the living room. And there are two sliding doors that go out to this backyard. One off the sitting area, off the living room, and one off the dining room. So they have a great fire pit out here. Oop, my son is making that very hard to see. Great fire pit. It is fully fenced. Beautiful stained deck. Plenty of seating. Very, very private back here. You cannot see a neighbor. There's the hot tub. And this is all um, concrete with uh, gravel inlay walking all the way around here and um, there is access to the garage and there is a tool shed right here and then that takes us out to there is fully fenced so let me open the gate so all the way around To the front port back out to the front so there you go 5624 otter way